Wake me up, it's time for 8 o'clock. <laughs> So today we are reviewing 8 o'clock coffee's French roast, which is supposed to be robust, smoky, and complex. And non-judgmental. <laughs> Unlike the French. Right. <laughs> okay, so, um, yeah, so 100% Arabica coffee. Arabica coffee, sorry. Mm -hmm. um, not much else to say about it, except for uh, they've it's, been in business for quite some time. Yeah, 1849, it, I believe. It's a brand everybody knows. Yes, uh, yeah, very well-known brand. It was a brand that we loved back when we first started trying flavor or brands other than Folgers, because yeah. Folgers was our go-to for years. Right. And then we kind of just started exploring coffee and then... We said... Yeah. Let's splurge and get some 8 o'clock coffee. <laughs> right. Speaking of price, uh, we paid like $7.49 a bag for this. It's a 12-ounce bag. Right. Um, although you can get it cheaper other places. Probably I bought it at Publix. But um, yeah, so mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, we've had other French roast coffees before and other 8 o'clock coffees uh, before, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. And uh, I don't remember the other French roast coffees yeah. in order to compare it to yeah yeah but we'll let this one stand alone and then let us let you know how yeah. many uh, donuts we give it right yeah so ready to yeah taste it? let's yeah. get right into it it does say that it's strictly high grown so that's that means uh, above 5400 feet or 4400 uh, feet yeah I, can't, yeah I can't remember the, the uh the owner of lake 503 coffee which we reviewed a couple of their coffees fantastic coffee by the way mm -hmm. uh explain to us what strictly high grown means and we have that uh, some yeah. I just don't have it on the top of my it. head. Yeah. yeah, Brian Plates. This is yes. Like, yeah, and so, so th this coffee does come from Latin America and East Africa. So like they use a bunch of different uh, beans to get their French roast. So, right. Yeah. So the question is, oh, it makes it classified as French roast. Like I think it's because of the darkness. It's like a really dark roast. Mm hmm. Okay. So it does have flavor. It does have flavor, a little bit bitter. Bitter, bitter flavor, mm -hmm. yeah. A little bit bitter, not unenjoyably so, but. So we've, this past week, we've been um, drinking both this and the uh, donut shop, New England. Uh, New England. And so whenever I would make myself coffee, I would go for this coffee over that one. Um, I mean, it's two totally different coffees, but. Um, I enjoyed this one okay. Yeah. It for the price that we paid for it, I I wouldn't buy it again. But if it was cheaper, you know. Yeah, it's a little dark for me, meaning it's uh, I think a little, little uh, bitter. But I kind of yeah, I kind of enjoy just a slight bitterness, just a little, you know, to to the coffee. But mm -hmm. um, yeah, it's it's pretty good, I'd say. Yeah. I give it like. A solid three. Okay, that's what I was gonna say. Yeah, like a solid three. I mean, yeah, for, yeah. For, because of the price. If it was right. cheaper coffee, then I might say, uh, you know, three and a half. Mm -hmm. but, yeah. Well, you should also check out our other eight o'clock coffee uh, reviews mm -hmm. and our other French roast reviews. Yes. And our other dark roast reviews. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, but let us know in the comments if you like eight o'clock, if you have yeah. a certain affinity for their brand yeah or if there's a if there's a roast that you particularly yeah, like roast. let us know we always like it when people recommend things i mean we don't always have the same opinion of it but we do appreciate those uh comments because yeah. we like to know like different things to try and mm -hmm. you know and what you guys think about it because yeah. certainly we're not the experts you guys no. you we know, are only the experts of our own mouths yeah, yeah everybody is their own expert of their own mouth that's right <laughs> Well, so do you have anything it. else to add about this other than the fact that my voice just cracked? No, I do not. All right. Well, thanks for joining us, everybody. Uh, and until next time. Keep grinding. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching our reviews. Please be sure to subscribe and check out our other reviews here.